Hey guys, it's you with HD here, and welcome back to Game Breakers. Today we're going to be taking a look at not really a glitch, but rather an exploit in Pokemon Sword and Shield. As you can probably see by the title, getting infinite money is still possible in this game. It's done by abusing the Cram-O-Matic, which is a feature in the Isle of Armor DLC. If you don't have it, then sadly, you're out of luck and cannot do the trick. For those who do though, let's go get all the Poke Dollars we want. So all you're going to need to do this is a little bit of pocket change and the Cremomatic unlocked inside the Master Dojo. But before we go in there, talk to this lady just outside the dojo who sells berries. She sells four different kinds, but the only ones we want to care about are the cherry berries. They sell for 80 polka dollars a pop, so buy four for 320 as we need four items to combine. If you don't have $320 at this point in the game, I don't really know what to tell you. Anyway, with the berries in your bag, head inside the dojo and over to the Cramomatic. This is where we can select 4 items to combine and it'll spit out a better item in return. There's a whole bunch of combinations, but all we need to focus on are the 4 cherry berries we just bought. Chuck them into the machine and it'll spit out TR-88 heat crash every single time. Now we just have to head out of the dojo and fly to any city in order to get to a Pokemon Center. Head inside and select sell to one of the shop guys. Select the TR we just got, which you'll notice is worth 3,000 Poke Dollars. Sell that bad boy, and boom, you just made a free $2,680 profit by basically doing nothing. From this point on, you can just repeat the process of buying berries, turning them into the Heat Crash TR, and selling it. I just went right ahead and bought the max amount of cherry berries for the small price of $79,920. Now it's just as simple as mashing the A button to keep turning the berries into TRs. If you have one of those automatic controllers that'll just mash A for you, that'd be really useful in this situation. But if not, you can just sit back, relax, and press the A button mindlessly. I personally just sat back on the couch and stared off into space until my thumb got sore, and I didn't even manage to convert all my berries, but doing some quick math will tell us how much profit is possible. With 999 berries, you can get 249 Heat Crash TRs. 3,000 times 249 is 667,320 Poke Dollars, which is what you'd get if you'd sold them all. Subtracting that out from our initial payment of 79,920 leaves us with a fat $587,400 profit. And that's all there is to it. A pretty simple and easy way to make infinite money in the Isle of Armor. I don't think they're really going to patch this one out as it's not really a glitch, but who knows with Nintendo anymore. If there are other glitches still out there in this game, I might cover them in the future, so if there are any you want to see, let me know in the comments below. I also should be back to making videos. Yeah. It seems like every time I say I'm back for good, something always comes up. But I think I can confidently say this time, I'm here to stay. Quick thanks to everyone who stuck around and all the new subs coming in recently. It's been helping out a lot. But for now, I'm gonna get up out of here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, see ya!